Welcome back boys and girls. How are you today? Right, this morning we are going to learn about a new subtopic in the main topic is measurement, okay? In the previous lesson we have touched about the ways to calculate the areas of an surface, okay? And also we estimate, okay, the areas for an in irregular shape. Okay, so for this new subtopic, okay, we are go for we are going to learn about more, okay, which is uh to the topic of volume, okay. Before we start the lesson, okay, do you know what is the meaning of volume? Okay, volume in actually in English there are more than one meaning. Okay, the first one volume is in Malay translation is isi padu. Okay. And the second meaning for volume is the volume of your sound. Okay, tahap uh, suara tinggi ataupun rendah. Okay, so there are two meanings that teachers uh, explain to you. Okay, simplest one. All right. So for today, we are going to touch about the volumes of a liquid. Okay, volumes of a liquid. Okay, isi padu untuk air. Okay, untuk minuman. Okay, so. Uh, before we start, okay, I give you a very simple analogy, okay, for this, uh, based on these pictures, okay. There are two boys in the pictures, okay, we name him as the green shirt, okay, boys is Michael, and the red jacket shirt is Jeff, okay. Michael and Jeff are good friends. One day, Michael and Jeff went to a park. They bought two ice cream in a cup. Michael bought an ice cream with a chocolate flavor and Jeff bought an ice cream with a strawberry flavor. All right. Based on these pictures, okay, as you can see, if you realize the size of these two ice cream is different. Did you realize that? <laughs> Take a look. Yeah, one is big, one is small, right? So now, what do we know about volume here? Okay, before I explain further, the volume is defined as total amount of space occupied by an object. Jumlah ruang yang dipenuhi oleh suatu objek ok so based on the pictures of the ice cream just now ok these two one is Jeff ice cream and another one is Michael's ice cream ok as we can see ok the Jeff ice cream ok occupy with a bigger scope but the Michael's ice cream is occupied with a smaller scope. Okay, as we can see, one is more higher, and another one is more little, right? So one is with a larger volume, another one is with a smaller volume. Okay, in Malay, maksudnya ice cream Jeff dipenuhi oleh scope ice cream yang lebih banyak. Okay. Lebih banyak maksudnya isi padu pun lebih ba banyak. Manakala, Michael's ice cream, okay, dipenuhi oleh skop yang kecil. Okay, itulah kita nampak isi padu, okay, dia lebih rendah dan lebih kecil. Dan kita nampak di sini, okay, these two pictures, okay, Michael's ice cream, okay, uh, lebih sedikit, okay, berbanding dengan Jeff punya ice. Script. All right. So, conclusion, which is larger volume and smaller volume. Very easy, am I right? All right. So we go to the next slide. Okay. In our daily life, okay, we need to drink water, am I right? Okay. On your left hand side, there is a uh, pictures of milk, and on your right hand side, there's pictures of uh, mineral water. Okay. As you can see here, okay, they write down there milliliter ml. 
and the other one is L, one L, which is liter. Okay, liter. Okay, uh, in the bracket, I say here he is the milk. We have ml is normally with a smaller volume, but if you saw uh, okay, uh, target of L, the other one is with a more big, bigger volume. Okay, one liter and milliliter. Okay, there's a difference of these two. Okay, one is big, bigger volume. Another one is a smaller volume. Okay, in Malay. Okay, kalau ml biasanya untuk isi padu yang lebih kecil. Kalau liter l, okay, huruf besar adalah untuk isi padu yang lebih banyak. Okay, untuk pengukuran. Okay, so uh, explain more further. Okay, need to go to next slide. Start from here. Okay, so before we go for the to the uh, measurements of uh, volume for the liquid okay we start from this one first okay a cube okay a cube okay cube what is a cube cube adalah kubus okay kubus dia seperti kotak tapi sisinya semua sama okay every edge of this box is the same Okay, from the length, wide, and high is the same. Okay, these pictures maybe they are uh, not that perfect, but cube. Okay, this is only the example. Okay, cube normally is occupied with the same length, same wide, and same high. Okay, sisinya mesti sama, panjang, lebar, tinggi mesti sama. Ini hanya contoh sahaja. Okay, <coughs> next. Okay, as you can see, okay, the side of an equal length, okay, which means the length A, the Y, B, the height C is equal. A equal to B, B equal to C, okay, A equals to B, B equals to C, which means the length is equal to the Y, and the Y is equal to the height. Alright, so in Malay, okay, panjang untuk A sana adalah panjang, B adalah lebar, C adalah ketinggian. Okay, maksudnya di sini pengukuran untuk lebar, okay, panjang, lebar dan ketinggian adalah sama. Okay, sama dengan B, B sama dengan C. Ini adalah untuk panjang untuk setiap sisi bagi kubus. Okay, English cube. We have a sides of equal length. Okay, for wide length and height, equally the same. Right? Okay, next. Okay, this is length. Okay, another one is wide. Another one is height. Okay, for information. Okay. For cuboid or cube, okay. The first one, the side here is a length, okay. Another one is wide, and go to upper side is high, okay. So lengths should be equals to wide and should be equals to high, okay. This is the rules for a cube, okay. Okay, next length, wide, and height. Okay, volume of a cube. Okay, the formula. Okay, formula of a volume of a cube is equals to length times y multiply with height. Okay, this is the volume of a cube. Okay, lengths. Multiple with the y and multiple with the height. Okay. So, for example, here, okay, we have a length one centimeter, wide centimeter, one centimeter, and height also one centimeter. Okay, the volume of a cube is equals to. Anybody know? 
okay is equal to one centimeter multiple with one centimeter multiple with another one centimeter the answer will be one centimeter cubic okay one cubic centimeter okay one cubic centimeter okay the length the y and the height okay so it's equals to one cubic centimeter in Malay okay ini adalah formula untuk isi padu okay isi padu okay formula untuk isi padu adalah panjang darab lebar darab ting tinggi maksudnya panjang satu meter lebar satu centimeter ketinggian satu centimeter so jawapan dia semua unit mesti sama so menghasilkan satu centimeter pa tu one cubic centimeter okay dengan syarat setiap satu mesti mempunyai uh, unit yang sama okay unit yang sa sama alright okay next cubic millimeter okay cubic millimeter okay millimeter okay this is another measurements of length okay we can use just now we use centimeter and then then now we are going to use millimeter okay millimeter is also the same okay length times the wide times the high okay we will get one cubic centi millimeter millimeter okay uh, sorry one cubic millimeter okay millimeter mm3 okay in Malay okay ini adalah untuk pengukuran untuk millimeter okay kalau kamu nak cari isi padu untuk kubus dalam millimeter pun boleh okay we will get one millimeter pa padu okay